at a couple locations and I'm melting both sides together. I wonder if this is solid now. You see it's one piece and what I would do is I probably find if it's the inside of a ring I do the repair there and I'm just going to carefully weld across that crack. Now it'll join it together and it'll leave very little marks or reference about where the crack was. But it's not a super strong weld. You know, it, it's not as durable as a one piece cast thing. But it may get you away from a completely destroyed piece to having a piece that still can be cast. And that looks pretty good. Now if there's any rough surfaces there, what I can do is I can use a bit of wax solvent, being careful not to deteriorate my design or damage the piece. And then I'm ready for casting. Here's a piece, joined back together. And that's fairly strong here. I'm wiggling in it and still not breaking. So those are some of the tools, the heat tools that we have. One of the last things to consider once you finish your wax work is to recycle the tiny pieces. All these pieces uh, can be remelted and reused, so gather them up and uh, place them in the melting pot. Usually I have a tray out where you can place them in and I recycle them later. Make sure all your tools go back to their proper location. Some of these specialized tools like um, dental picks and, and uh, exactos need to be returned for safety and to make sure that they don't get lost.